this 23rd day of May 2018. I want to ask uh, Sam if he would lead us in a prayer and a place to play. Most gracious Heavenly Father, Lord, we just come to you tonight, Lord. We just ask for your guidance in all that we do, Lord. We just ask that you would bless this county, Lord Jesus. We just ask for your your peace and harmony to be. And, and Lord, just touch each and every heart in it. Lord, help us and guide us tonight through our decisions we make. Help us to involve you in every decision we make. In Christ's name I pray. Amen. 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 I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, God and the visible liberty, justice for all. Uh, now we're going to do the LGEA and CRA public hearing that we do every year. Uh, so that uh, public hearing is now in order. Um, Ann, you want to say just a, bit, a bit and then see if they've got questions here? Uh, we just have to uh, announce our money that we receive from the county road aid for our next budget year, which is $1,545,919. And from our LGEA money, $440,000. Let's see if any citizens have any requests or suggestions. Okay. Uh, that's something that we do every year, and uh, it's already in the budget that's in front of you. So, with that said, uh, this public hearing is adjourned, and we're back into our regular meeting. Uh, before you gentlemen, you have the May the 8th, 2018 minutes to have motion to approve. Move. Sam? Second. Second, Joe Barnes. Any questions, corrections, or additions? Being none, all in favor say aye. Aye. Opposed, like sign. Motion carries. Before you, you have the bills, claims, payments, and transfers. Uh, the motion to approve. Motion by Larry Cam. Second. Second by Sam Small. Any discussion? Any discussion? Being none, roll call, Miranda. Bullock? Yes. Barnes? Yes. Johnston? Yes. Town? Yes. Morphew? Yes. Small? Yes. Uh, Sheriff, you want to present your settlements? Say aye. 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 Opposed, like sign. Motion carries. Thank y'all. Uh, as you remember, the last meeting we passed Budget Amendment 2018-3. It's what you needed to get us through the rest of this fiscal year. Uh, I need a motion to approve that second reading. I'll make a motion to approve. Motion with Jason. One second. Second by Larry Cowan. Oh, I got him first. So. Uh, uh, me. It don't matter. It don't matter. It ain't gonna fight over it. Uh, is there uh, any discussion on that? Being none, go ahead and roll call that. Bullock? Yes. Barnes? Yes. Johnson? Yes. Cowan? Yes. Morphew? Yes. Small? Yes. Um, we have to prove every year. This is for the next budget, right? Yes. The standing orders. 
that's the thing that we do, stuff that we do every month. Uh, but we have to uh, do that every year. So if you would, I need a motion to approve the standing orders. So moved. Motion of Sam Small. I'll second. Jason Bullock seconded it. A uh, motion by Sam Mall, second by Jason Bullock, to approve the 2018-19 standing orders. Is there any discussion or questions? Judge, is there anything we can do on the, like the phone where we got so many different phones that we can consolidate or see if there's any savings out there on that? We actually have several times. Okay. And every year there'll be somebody got this better than yeah better than sliced bread plan. And then when we really get their price and all together, they either don't give us a price set to get our needs or it's not less. Okay. And we just went recently went through an audit and, and deleted about five lines, but then the phone company has raised the prices, so. Yeah, what about on like, I, I didn't think maybe on sales phones too. You know. uh, I mean, we don't, we have seven. Yeah. I mean, I don't know of any oh. extras. Any other questions or discussion? Ben, I'm going to call that. Bullock? Yes. Barnes? Yes. Johnston? Yes. Cam? Yes. Morphew? Yes. Small? Yes. As we presented to you last week, you'll have our budget proposal. Uh, we need to get the first reading of it off. Some of you, I'm sorry to get talked to you today, have talked about some uh, uh, changes decided not to do that and handle that problem another way a little bit later on or just the, the, the issue not problem so uh, I presented it to you for the first reading and uh, I will need a second Is yeah. the, I was just going to ask you're saying there's some changes now the 11 points that's the only changes that's been changed in the budget that you mailed us that's just something people No, I mean you your your what you was mailed the last time is what's good. That this so this is good right here. Okay. That was just a sheet telling what was changed from the yes. prior time. It came in the mail. About a week or two ago. You want you need one? Yeah. Matter of fact, Joe, some of those was your request. <coughs> So nothing's changed since then. That's no. all I want. We took several items out of the uh, LGEA and put them into the general fund. We put the ambulance. I said several items. We put the ambulance in there, and then we took several things, including the firefighters. It says that every department has 2.1 TBI increase. Yes. Is that minus it, it the just, magistrates? It just has it in there. You all have not approved that yet. But it's in the budget to pay it. It's, it's not been. There'll be a separate issue. Yeah, that's separate. You all have to address that. But this is the funding. Did I have a second? I'll second. Second. Did you have a motion? Yeah, I make the motion. I'll present it. Uh, and on the, I didn't see in the rope fund any uh, fifty two money. I thought okay. It's right here, Larry. She explained that to you that day. It comes down here. This 480,000 from the way they redone our coast severance money, we have to move it down for the project money. And it's on the top of the list. It comes down out of the LGEDF. Yeah, but it's not budgeted. Is that something that, uh, you know? It goes with the budget. It's, it's here. We haven't got the rest of the projects to know. That's just the ones that we must do right there. But it's going to be 480,000. For the roads, yeah. Okay, Here's 480 because this is 400. How are we going to divvy it up for? Just like the other, like Chip and Sale, same as always. It replaces it in the LGEA, it'd be just exactly like that. So when will we get that money? Yeah, because we haven't, we haven't, we, we're the next meeting, we've got to prove our list, and it could be early, early July. Hmm. I'd rather approve the list first. Well, we can't, don't have time to do that. We've got to get our projects in. Did we the take departments out? are all turning in their uh, five-year plans. <laughs> Did we take out the money that was in there for Chicken Seal? I didn't see it in the, in the budget. Right. Took it out. 
Well, because it's moved so from LGEA to LGEDF. So they get our money that way. So where did so that give us more of that and less did of that, that money go to? We took the. We reduced the revenue. You know the from LGEA money that we get quarterly, and the LGEDF money is in the Haskell money. What I believe they have done is they have increased the Haskell money and decreased the quarterly money. Yes. I received an email from Amy Barnes telling us what they estimated our quarterly money to be for the year. Mm -hmm. I believe, I've got her email here, I believe it was 323000 And she's only estimated like, what, 98000 to go on for? Well, that was for the year. But that's what that... So, when this, we, this we will put back, back the exact amount you got last year in Tiffany Silver. Yeah. The exact amount. When we went back in the LGEA budget, instead of the Plus 790, we had the wall for, uh, other road, road fund. To be more realistic Plus of what, what we're going to actually road, get. Yeah, 80000 in the regular road fund. I'll be quite frank. Hey. Right I, uh, I'd, I'd like to see it in the budget. But, uh, well, you can't hardly do that. Do it's you see the uh, line that says a million dollars? That's the house bill money. So that is what you all will be approving on that list. And we'll do next year's too. Well, I'd like to approve the list first before we. I went to it. I'd like to see how much will my the fifth district be getting of that and in the <clears throat> four hundred and eighty. It's the same you got last year. I and think then, you know, last year was one hundred and twelve. Yeah. It's going by percentages, just like it did on the LGA. So out of uh, four million and some dollars, we get a hundred thousand dollars for for uh, repair of roads, chip and seal, or blacktop, or whatever. Is that the best we're going to be able to do? That's the question. There's another eighty there, and then there'll be another four hundred in the second year. Of it. Uh, I will say this, um, Charlie, and you all met with FEMA today, uh, and I believe he said. Until you get it in writing, you never know that our part should be 1.6 million that we should be getting 87% of for the but FEMA. But that's just to take care of the damage. It's not. Yeah, but we we pretty whole, much done all of that. A whole lot right. of it. We've paid for it. It's now. We've paid so, for it now, and this will give it back. Most so the when money, will we possibly be getting that? They told him six to eight months, so it should be. Yeah, but we sometime. still got several projects we still got to do. Yeah. So. Six to eight months will put you January the first. Yeah. It, it would be next black top of the season. Yeah. yeah. Which we need mm -hmm. to we really need to do our money now because roads is horrible. Roads are Well, of the four hundred and eighty thousand that's the first thing on his proposed list, we know we have two hundred and sixty six thousand in our account up at the state right now. So come July one I will send Amy Barnes the request to draw down that money. And then we'll get our next quarterly deposit at the end of July, 1st of August. So I, I feel confident that the 480000 will be there to do that black topic. Yeah, the timetable is going to be wrong, though, and if it does come in the last of July or 1st of August, middle of September, whatever, the, uh, the days of patching is just about over. I mean, you got four or five districts. Uh, then, uh, it, it, it poses a serious problem for us as far as roads is concerned. Well, I feel comfortable saying that when I request this 266, we'll get it immediately. So you all, July 1, should be ready to go with your money. David, I think we've done some things here on this list. You know, we, we cut out some more money out of the golf course and we moved it and put it in so we could do. Uh, raises and they were going to have money left over in the golf course and, but i talked to you about a couple other ways to set some money to where we could shore up some retirement for all the partners and i and then also with not passing the uh severance list yet i just don't know about you well i we had worked with y'all and i really thought we had this worked out where we could do the budget and uh, like i said i made several changes uh in your uh that you requested and I made uh, I, I opted not to deal with the project we talked about last night in the way that we agreed uh, we talked about we didn't agree on but I looked into it and researched it in full uh, detail and decided to handle it a different way 
which the re same result may come about, but not with this budget. Uh, tell you what we could do. We could vote to approve these first four items on this and, and move forward and then finish the list at the next meeting. First, uh, first is 480,000 for roads. Committed already that we have to, the 90,000 to park debt service and the $150,000 to OSEDA because that was in the last one. That's just like a carryover. And then, because by the end of the next year, we're gonna need an ambulance, even though we are not don't have it in this budget, I put 125 for ambulance. So if y'all want to prove these first four things. See, I would, I would like to drop OSEDA out there. They got 120,000 in their account and they're getting the TDA money and we're, they're gonna get all the TDA money. But it's already was approved last year. These, are well, these two are carryovers. But we've also had things in the past on the co-servants list that was approved and we run out of money and it didn't get put back on the next list. So, yeah. I mean, we can drop it. Well, I know I've really committed to uh, uh, economic development. We don't want our county to dry up. We've got to have it. Once you get to a million dollars in that fund, then it will roll and it will be self-sustaining itself. They won't ever have to have people put in it. Also, we don't need the load of roads just keep getting behind it. Well, this, this address is at 480. budget we'll drop right back here and do this first four hours. Do we want to approve some of those things? I mean at least put the road thing in there. If that's I mean I don't think that's an issue because everybody agrees that we're gonna put the road money in there first thing. So, I mean do we need to make I mean I can put that in my motion to approve the budget. I know we're getting that so I don't know what I think the issue is when you when you get it. Yeah but I mean by delaying it it may only delay. Well, let me tell you, you something. We're going to be in trouble if we don't approve the first three of the, the budget. Our timetable's running out. We need to go with it. I've worked with y'all every way you can work and give you every opportunity for input. I've talked to each of you about it. Uh, and I made lots of changes to suit some of you. So it needs to roll. And I will come right back with a motion to approve these four numbers here to approve the first three of the budget. And you can tweak the budget on the second read. But we've got to get to Frankfurt for them to look over. But now, last time when we talked about that, channel. we said we could tweak it to the second reading, and then when I brought it back up, we said, well, that had to be done in the first Well, reading. no, I, I, didn't, I didn't have the money to do it. I don't know for that. But we, we just didn't have the well, money just, to do it. Right. The reason reading. we're getting behind on this is the states drew up their feet, and they didn't send us the, what we needed on their retirement stuff. So it's really their fault, partly. It, it is, but they didn't, they didn't give us any change in the rules. So, but I mean, it, it, my understanding, we can tweak anything in a budget. You can. Throughout the year, we need to tweak some stuff. Oh, yeah. I mean, yeah, that's you just because you anything. don't mean you can't tweak a budget. Yeah. Right. But you got to pass them. we got to pass this and get them. They may change it. DLG may. So we need it to, for a second. But we need to get this to them. And y'all had it for several days to look over. So it's only made in second. Go second to Jason Bullock. Go ahead and roll call. Bullock? Yes. Barnes? No. Johnson? Yes. Town? No. Morphew? No. Small? Yes. I say you guys are just, for whatever your reason is, just doesn't, don't want to work with county government to make it work. Because I've given you copies of it. Uh, some of you have even committed. Joe, you even said if I change them things for you, you'd go for it. Larry, you told Ann the other day you'd go for it. And After, well, I just got the budget and I seen the changes here on the front and I didn't have any big disagreement with it until I looked over the budget and found out the chip and seal money was gone. And then that has a tendency. A wise man changes his mind sometimes. Yeah, but I, I'm a... And, and my, my reason for opposition on the budget, David, is just what yeah. I, if you've been listening, told you about the road money. I'm not going to be satisfied with the road money coming in in the last of August or whatever when we don't have any time left to get the job done. Now, that's my opposition. Well, if I had a way of doing it quicker, I would. 
And if FEMA money comes first, it goes into that fund. We can work that around. If push came to shove, and, and I feel like we will get at least the 266 in pretty quick, but if push came to shove, we have enough in the emergency savings to use as a cash flow until we get it in. But quite frankly, guys, when I look at the budget, we got four million and some dollars in road fund, and I'm up here trying to squabble uh, over a budget for a, for if you get 260 in for 50 or 60 thousand dollars or 200 miles of county roads. I just I'm not going to vote for a budget like that. That's just my mind. I feel the same way. I got 28 and a quarter percent of the roads and. 99 percent of the calls I get is on the roads. And it, it may not have been as bad, but we had a very difficult winter. And we all know that it sets on this court because we get complaints of whatever yeah. and we've looked at them. And, and uh, maybe in a different year it might have been different. Well, like I said, you've all had a chance to come in and talk to me about this. And you haven't. We've been working on this since uh, February or March at the latest. We've been working on this budget. I've taken input, but in the end, everybody can't have everything they want in it. It's got to be a deal, and uh, if y'all would look at it for the good of the county, you'd realize this is a good budget. Yeah, it's awful to say that I'm guilty of uh, wanting a little road money. Write her down. Yeah, it, we got road money, and it's all in the, in the works here. <laughs> and every time me and you talk, David, all I, I, most things I bring up is about the roads, why we need to get more money in that, and we just talked about it here the latter part of the week. Well, we've done, uh, David, know, we lot. talked about my issues, and uh, we've been pretty open with you on it. You we didn't even last night. You said, well, we'll talk about it, and then when I come in here today, you said you're going to do it another way. Well, I said that one thing I wasn't going to do. So, you, you've got a lot in that budget you wanted. Well, mainly we money. all we did was just move things around in other departments. I mean, other 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 to uh, other accounts from one fund to another. Yeah. So if we Switch get short money. on coal severance money this time, we don't cut out our ambulances or our fire departments or something. We'll cut out something we can withstand and make it work instead of contracts we got with other things right. that would get us in lawsuits. But well, I agree to that. Anyway, yeah. that's fine. You can tell me however you want to tell me and get mad at me because I told you what I wanted. Well. And, we're not getting anywhere, so. Yeah, well, you got what you wanted, a lot of it. And uh, for whatever reason, some of you just do not want to work with the uh, process. You had every opportunity to sit in. I said we come up with enough money to take care of the retirement absorptions. Then, you know, that would be definitely for it. We haven't even done that. Yeah. I said if we come up with some partial of it. So, actually, it's it's a very good. Uh, that's addressed very well in this budget, and it's handled very well. Well, I do appreciate you getting the ambulance into the general fund and getting it out of the LGA because well, that's a responsible thing to do. And yeah, I hated about the retirements too, but we did talk about that when the money came in, if extra money came in, that would be the first the, things addressed. I tried to do the ambulance last last year. We had the first reading and so said we'd look at it in the second reading and that's when I was told, well, that needed to be done in the first reading. Well, so I know how that first reading and second reading works it, it's out. In, it's in there. You're, you're only, uh, what you're doing is, to, is stalling it, making it difficult on the citizens of the county. That's all you're doing. Uh, and uh, with that, we'll move on and uh, we will call uh, local government to see what their suggestion is on uh, deadline. Because like I said, I've compromised all that we can do with each one of you have. Maybe you have compromised with me whatsoever. Now don't set up our oh, yeah. this all in yeah. My gosh. We, well, I haven't even talked to you. Well we got the, I mean we got the money there the only for the thing, and, 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 and this is not personal and certainly don't take it personal. It's not meant to be. But I'm 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 up here and we've got to, we've got some serious road problems and I want to try to address them and with a four point some million dollar road budget I feel like there's ways that we can. Whether we have to take it from other, other uh, uh, things with the other item lines in the budget or within the road department, I don't have a problem with that. But yeah. I want some money to work with as we start. Yeah. Well, we we and had told you we've got ways of transferring some money in to begin with, and this 480 when it comes in will replace that. Money. 
Yeah, but the timetable on that ain't right. I mean, if, if you wanted to, uh, if you wanted to look at borrowing the money from, from Cato or whatever, where we could have that money available, where we could get started in the. And this already is spring, if you realize this, we're right up on June. Well, we we have about three months. We can free up to $150,000 in cost severance to go towards roads, too. Instead of going to OC, that they're sitting on 120. dollars And they're going to get the TVA money starting this year. Mm -hmm. I don't so, think for the budgets, it's just it's month, road, road and it's And that's just for the loan program. That's not for the knocking out OC. We get $50,000 from the TVA. That's his operating budget. Yeah, fifty thousand. Yeah. Okay. Well, look, I'm, I haven't had anybody to say that they would, so I'll put it down as a tie. Let's see if there's any. Um. Okay, we're deadlocked on that issue. Uh, we're really pushing a timetable on getting this to DLG, but we've done. I've done my part. And got it too. Uh, quite a ball count. Uh, okay. We're going to move on. I'm making an appointment to the Property Valuation Appeals Board. Uh, as many of you know, uh, Dan Shatmar passed away. He was on that board. And I'm appointing Anthony Maddox to replace him. Uh, and that just needs a simple roll call. Pull up. Yes. Barnes? Yes. Johnston? Yes. County? Yes. Morphew? Yes. Small? Yes. Okay. Uh, are there any committee meetings, have or any committees met since the last meeting that has a report to make? Uh, Renetta has asked the, uh, 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 the uh, Madman Code uh, Board to meet, committee just to meet a few minutes right after this meeting. She said it would not be over 15. Admin code. Helena County came by today. Uh, we've got some people on the cemetery board that are no longer able to go out and do. She's a representative for Rosine, Horse Branch, and Forza. Okay. I don't see anyone here. We'll need to make some calls. Make us know. We'll need to make some calls to who can do that. I don't even think that that committee has to be appointed in the uh, in the meeting. Just anybody would get willing to serve. Any other committees, Matt? Being none, magistrates, same. No. Jason, Joe. Yeah, I got two things. I had someone call me on the, I uh, don't know if they're on the uh, cemetery committees, but yes. there was a question about, a, I believe the cemetery is called Tunnel Hill, and it's down in Eccles, and they, trying to get access to it, the roads are bad. Uh, I'm gonna look into it. I thought he might be here. Is there so a can, can, is it a county road? That's what we're gonna have to find out as far as I know there's it's not, but we don't know if they got an easement or if you grown can, up and uh, if you get easements we can take them in and we can uh, grab them and grab them once the right I, I don't know what the oh, issue sure. is but it could be what some of the people call about on on the council they can look at it yeah if we can get to so i was going to talk to justin about it too and see if there's we have taken in several cemetery road roads on that low maintenance right road, but you still have to have the easement signed in the petition they've got to come and get a justin do they have to come get some paperwork so they can get the easements in that how we have to do it All right. let's yeah. check to see if there's any if there's been any adoption of the county road if there is not if you keep tells you it's not then yeah come see and <coughs> try to look something up and and then, yeah, they would need to sign uh, and it's it's that we could prepare. Yeah. But, but ask Keith first, and after you talk to me, call me up, Joe, and we'll, we'll call him. You know where to go. After you talk to him. Let me make sure I do now. It goes up a big hill. To the left or what? And then, yeah. I had a little issue. Uh, Keith had said something. Oh, sorry. Oh, that's right. Mr. Keith is something about it. there was having some issues getting some uh, paperwork from the rock quarry about so they could get it to FEMA some documentation. And I thought he was going to be here tonight to talk about it. Yeah, because I, was, I wasn't aware of that. Okay. Of any, if it is, we're talking. Do we need to call a road committee for the next 